subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Jupyter Notebook is an open source, interactive web application that allows you to create and share live code, equations, visualizations, and narrative text. It supports various programming languages, but in this tutorial, we'll focus on using Python in Jupyter Notebooks. Before getting started, you need to have Python installed on your system. You can install Jupyter Notebook using the following steps. Open your terminal or command prompt. Run the following command to install Jupyter using pip. Alternatively, you can use conda if you have Anaconda installed. Once installed, you can launch Jupyter Notebook by running the following command in your terminal or command prompt. This will open a new tab in your web browser showing the Jupyter dashboard. The Jupyter Notebook interface consists of cells. There are two main types of cells. Let's create a simple Python code example. Click on a code cell, type your Python code, and then run the cell by clicking the run button or using the shortcut shift plus enter. Markdown cells allow you to add text, headers, lists, and more to your notebook. You can create a markdown cell, type your content, and format it using markdown syntax. Jupyter Notebooks support inline visualizations. You can use libraries like Matplotlib or Seaborn to create charts. You can save your work by clicking the Save button or using the shortcut Ctrl plus S. To export your notebook, go to File Download as and choose a format, example HTML, PDF, or Markdown. This tutorial provides a basic introduction to Jupyter Notebooks with Python. Explore more features and capabilities of Jupyter as you continue your data analysis, machine learning, or scientific computing projects. Jupyter Notebooks offer a powerful and flexible environment for interactive computing and sharing your work with others. ChatGPT